Alcido explains what's happening this week with bills that could impact crime if they become law. One bill is named after 13-year-old Benny Hargrove, a middle school student who was shot and killed by another 13-year-old who allegedly used his dad's gun. If it becomes law, it would penalize gun owners with fines or criminal charges if a minor gets a hold of their unsecured gun. Senator Daniel Ivy Soto is one of the bill's sponsors. He says this bill won't affect most New Mexicans. This is saying we applaud you who are being responsible gun owners. We need to make sure everybody else follows your lead. The bill is now in the House Judiciary Committee. It'll have to clear one more committee before it goes to the House floor. Next, there's a proposal to build baby boxes at local fire departments in all counties. It would be safe places for a woman to leave a baby with no questions asked. And once the baby is dropped off, personnel inside would be alerted. It's not a boundary of where in the state it is. It's about safety of the children and giving the mom an option. The proposal was created after police say an 18-year-old woman in Hobbs threw her newborn in a dumpster. Another bill would keep anyone charged with what are called serious violent offenses or a felony in jail before their trial. These are dangerous crimes. We would like you to look very carefully at whether releasing them is in the best interest of public security. That bill just passed through one committee and is now headed to another before going to the floor. Angel Salcido, KOAT, Action 7 News. Legislature is also reviewing a bill to pay themselves a salary for the first time in history. We're going to have more on that for you at 5.